Hello and welcome to another EF2000 Tacticom Let's Play video. Today we're going to demonstrate the launching of the BL755 cluster bomb. It was developed by the British in the 1960s and the bomb distributes some 147 submunitions over an area the size of a football pitch. It's really useful against grounded planes, surface to air missile sites and oil facilities. It's not so good on bridges. Okay, let's go into the simulator and select the BL-755 tutorial mission. We've got to destroy at least two ships with these cluster bombs. So let's do this! So here we are in the Eurofighter, we're about 10,000 feet and if we look on our mini-map by pressing Shift and M, we just need to fly straight ahead. So here's the Eurofighter, the outside of our plane, and there's two cluster bombs that we can use. Now you should launch these at quite a high speed, maybe about 500 knots or more, so the ground, any ground defences won't attack you. Here's the ships. There's three of them in a, in a line. Now we're going to launch at slightly lower speed, because I know there's no enemy ground defences. Now we can locate these ships using the Joint Tactical Information Distribution System, JTIDS. Enemy ground vehicles at 355 degrees. 15, can you intercept? Copy. JTIDS, it's a passive means of searching for ground targets and even air targets. So we don't have to use our radar or our active sensors. And this is good because we remain stealthy and the other enemies won't know we're coming. Uh, we've been told where to go to attack these ground targets. So we're going to lose altitude now. Using our air brake as well to slow us down. We're going to throttle back and head along these waypoints that have been set for us. Three hundred fifty-five degrees, same angel, zero. So there's the bay ahead of us, that's where the ships are heading out of the docks. Now the BL-755 bomb is best launched at about 150 feet. So we're going to try and get as low as we can and launch these bombs. And then we can see the lights of the city there and a tunnel behind us, a railway tunnel. Now there's the bomb fall line. You can see a horizontal little marker and that indicates where you should drop your cluster bombs. Now we're closing in onto the target area. We can see the buildings of the docks. And I'm going to throttle right back so we can see exactly how to launch these bombs. There's the first ship. We've got to line her up slowly and get the bomb release marker over it. There's the ship. Bombs away! Now oh, you can see those bomblets spreading out and that's one ship down. And here's another one. Bombs away! Wow. Mission accomplished, well done. Excellent. Well there we have it. Well that's that, I hope you enjoyed that, thanks for watching, until next time, bye bye!